There, I'd like to show uh, one of my new inventions I've been working on for quite some time. As we all know, the jars today, they come in different configurations and different styles. And it's kind of nice to have a handle on it, but you pour this stuff out. And then it's kind of hard to get the rest to scoop the thing in there. And you've got all this waste that's on the inside. And you just have to throw that in the garbage. And the ants and the mice love to have at it. But uh, the new design I've been working on for a while is basically the same, but the bottom pushes up. There's O-rings integrated into the bottom. So you would just pour it in like you normally do. And there again, the stuff sticks on the side. But here, you clean it up like that. Wipe off the top. The, the new design I have has an integrated stop to hold the piston at the top. And then bingo, there you go. A nice, clean, perfect jar with all the contents out, as opposed to something like this. So, we all have peanut butter, and when the jar gets empty, it's hard to get access, and you get in there, and the peanut butter gets all over the side and everything, and it's a pain, okay? But, if we have it in a bottoms-up jar, and we use all that we can, we can just simply push up the contents, the little bit that's left, and at the very end, just wipe it on the bread, just wipe it on the bread, just like that, and the piston will be virtually clean, and the jar will be clean. Here's our last and final example of what we can use the jar for. We can also use it for industrial uses like paint. Use the jar like you normally do, and paint your wood and whatever. And then what's nice about this is that when you're done, you can put the lid back on the jar. And hopefully the, the new lid will have a, a pour spout if you want to pour it, and also a pleater valve. And the advantage of this would be to push up the paint until it gets to the very top and just ooze it out of the top just a little bit right there and then put the cork back in and then it would never skin it would it would all be the oxygen would take out and it would prevent this this is a half filled jar of paint which when the oxygen gets in there it skins and it locks well with this Years from now, you can just pop this off and pour it, and there'd be no skinning. For an industrial use, this would be really nice to have.